Oh, I don't feel so good. Oh, uh, hi there, boys and girls. <laughs> um, I think I ate too much junk food. Oh, my tummy. Oh, what's in that stuff anyway? What is that? Let's see, there's the ingredients right there. Hmm, sugar, corn syrup, honey, dextrose, fructose, sucrose, and partially discombobulated oil. Oh, I tell you, this stuff, it'll kill you. Oh, it make my tummy hurt. We are Deborah and Eric Heath, the way of Dragon Wings. And we live in Eastern Maryland. Yes, we do. I've always loved marionettes, so I decided that I would try my hand at marionette making and started building them, and it has grown from there. <laughs> When I joined Deborah, she was already making marionettes, and I had I had had a, a little bit of experience in marionette making, so it was really fun to jump right in and and uh, see what I could do mm. to help to make them mechanically more uh, special. This is a troll bridge now, and I eat goats. I feel that um, with each performance, it's important to to help the kids to understand life maybe a little bit better, or maybe to uh, solve some personal problems they may have through watching what the puppets are going through. And in our story of the three billy goats gruff, we're hoping that kids um, can see that not everybody looks the same, and there's diversity in the world, and, and with the story of the goats, they were afraid of the troll in the beginning because he looked kind of scary and very different from them. And then they figured out that he was really very much like they, and um, he was looking for a friend. And in the story, the goats sort of help somebody who's very different to become their friend. And they overcame that fear. He would be a lot more fun for you to wrestle with than me. Besides, I'm a dancer, not a wrestler. Hey, wait a minute. How would you like to learn how to dance? Oh, that would be fun. Yeah. So when we come into a school system or a library, we bring our puppet theater, which is it fills a trailer out in the back. We uh, we will bring all the pieces in and assemble the the theater so that it has a beautiful stage with a curtain that raises and we're hidden behind the scenes so the children see the, the whole puppet show with just the puppets and it's a magical magical experience and then after we finish uh, doing the the regular show after we finish the show then we come out with the puppets and show the children how they work we take each one out individually and and show them the different strings and what they pull on the marionette and uh, we talk a little bit about the show and how they felt about the characters and what they may have learned from the show. And that's always a lot of fun. We're trying to bring some of the magic to children in the art of puppetry. Mm -hmm. 